Okay, so here's an example of Bluetooth connection and sending and plotting data um, from a Raspberry Pi onto an Android app. So what we have right here is we have a Python program called just test SDP for service discovery protocol. And then so if I run this program, um, it didn't run. Okay, so it's listening on port one for any incoming connection and then on the app I can open the Bluetooth devices and this searches for all discoverable devices and so it found the Raspberry Pi there um, so I select the Raspberry Pi and then now that it's selected these buttons become visible and it's asking to pair with the Raspberry Pi so I push OK and then you can see um, on the SSH that it accepted the connection. So what this application does is I can just input a number, say 8, and then input a number like 8. I don't know what was going on there, so 5 I guess. Um, and if I send it then this reads that I got a 5 and it generates the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Well now, from here, I get this plot of the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Um, if I would choose... Oh, I have to run the program again. Because it only does it once. So if I refresh the connection and I choose four this time. It'll give me one, two, three, four. And then this only plots one, two, three, four. And so I can run it even again. Maybe this time let's choose seven. I send seven and I get seven. So right now this is just a rough graph. As you can see, the graph isn't labeled. It fills in the screen wrong. But we could use this for sending data from the spectrometer to the app.